Imagine waking up in the middle of the night, feeling an eerie presence in your room. You turn around and there it is. A creature, a nightmare incarnate, the rake. Picture this, a seemingly ordinary night, the kind where the moon hangs high and the stars twinkle silently, but within the shadows of your room, something lurks. A sense of dread fills the air, a chill runs down your spine and your heart pounds in your chest like a drum. Suddenly you see it, it's not human. And yet it's not entirely a beast either. It's a ghastly figure, a grotesque entity that seems to have sprung from the darkest crevices of your worst nightmares. It's known as the Rake, a name that sends shivers down the spines of those who dare utter it. It stands on all fours, its eyes glowing ominously in the darkness, its mouth twisted into a terrifying grin that reveals rows of sharp, menacing teeth. Its appearance alone can make a brave man tremble, a sight so chilling that it haunts the minds of those who have encountered it long after it's gone. Its story is whispered in hushed tones, shared in quiet corners, spoken of only with a sense of respect and fear. The rake has become a symbol of terror, a creature that feeds off the fear it instills in its victims. Yet despite its terrifying reputation, there's a certain allure to the rake. An enigma wrapped in a mystery, it has captured the fascination of many. Its origins remain unclear, its motives unknown. Is it a predator seeking its prey in the dead of night? Or perhaps it's a creature misunderstood, labeled a monster due to its grotesque appearance? The rake is a creature that is enthralled and terrified in equal measure. It has become a subject of countless discussions, theories and debates. Some dismiss it as a mere urban legend, a creation of the human mind, while others believe it to be a very real entity that lurks in the shadows of the night. What could this creature be? A figment of imagination or a creature from the depths of the unknown? Let's dive into the darkness to uncover the truth. The rake, a name that sends shivers down the spine, has been a part of folklore for centuries. This entity, often described as a horrific humanoid creature, has left its mark in tales spun around campfires, in whispered conversations, and in the annals of internet folklore. The legend of the rake traces back to the early centuries, with its origins diffused across the globe. In some cultures, it's a cautionary tale, a creature that lurks in the shadows, preying on the fears of the innocent. In others, it's a harbinger of doom, it's citing a signal of impending disaster. In the heart of Europe, it was believed to be a nocturnal creature that roamed the dark forests, its chilling scream echoing through the night. Across the vast expanse of the Atlantic, among the Native American tribes, tales were spun about a creature that could shapeshift, a true master of disguise, known for its eerie silence before striking its victims. As we journey to the Far East, the rake takes on a different form, more spectral than corporeal, a ghostly figure that feeds on the life force of its victims. Yet, despite the differing descriptions, one common thread weaves these stories together, the overwhelming sense of dread and terror that the rake instills. In recent times, the internet has become a hotbed for alleged sightings and encounters with the rake. Grainy videos, blurry photographs, and spine-chilling testimonials seem to fuel the fire of this legend. From a lone hiker in the Appalachian Trail to a night guard in a Russian factory, accounts of encounters with this creature continue to surface, each more terrifying than the last. However, no concrete evidence has been found to prove its existence. Skeptics argue that the rake is merely a product of overactive imagination, a boogeyman created to explain the unexplainable. Yet believers stand by their experiences, their fear all too real. With each sighting, the mystery of the rake deepens, blurring the line between reality and myth. As we continue to delve into this enigma, we can only wonder, does the rake truly exist or is it just a figment of our collective fear? As we delve deeper into the mystery, one question remains. Is the rake real or just a figment of our collective fear and imagination? The rake, a creature that sends chills down our spine, a thing of nightmares, has been a subject of intense debates. Is it a creation of our subconscious mind or does it truly lurk in the shadows? Here we explore the various theories and explanations that might shed some light on this enigma. From a scientific perspective, some argue that the rake could be an undiscovered creature a remnant from a bygone era, hidden in the recesses of our world. Others suggest it could be a grotesque mutation, a product of our tampering with nature. However, without solid evidence, these theories remain speculative. 
Psychologists offer a different explanation. They propose that the rake might be a manifestation of our deepest fears and anxieties, a symbol of the unknown that we project onto the world. This idea resonates with Carl Jung's concept of the shadow, the dark side of our psyche that we suppress and often see reflected in our nightmares. Paranormal enthusiasts, on the other hand, believe the rake to be a supernatural entity, a malevolent being from another realm. They point to numerous encounters and eerie tales as evidence of its existence. Then, there's the impact of mass hysteria, a phenomenon where a group of people collectively imagine threats or disturbances that aren't real. Could the fear of the rake be a classic case of mass hysteria, fueled by our innate fear of the unknown? Lastly, we cannot underestimate the role of the Internet in amplifying the legend of the rake. The digital age, with its countless forums and social media platforms, has become a fertile ground for such urban legends to thrive and spread. Whether real or fictional, the rake continues to haunt our nightmares and fuel our fascination with the unknown. From hushed whispers in the dark to the glaring lights of Hollywood, the rake has infiltrated our popular culture. This creature, born of myth and mystery, has clawed its way into our collective imagination, leaving a chilling mark that's hard to ignore. In the world of cinema, The Rake has found a home. Movies such as The Rake and Rake have capitalized on the creature's chilling lore, spinning tales of terror that have left audiences wide-eyed and hearts pounding. The creature's ghastly image, its bone-chilling whispers, and its relentless pursuit of its victims have been portrayed with a terrifying realism that has left viewers clutching their popcorn in fear. But it's not just the silver screen that has been captivated by the rake. The literary world has also been ensnared by its mythos. Countless books and stories have been penned, each adding a new layer of dread to the creature's legend. From horror anthologies to spine-tingling novels, the rake has found a way to creep into our bookshelves and onto our reading lists. And let's not forget the internet, the place where the rake truly came to life. The creature's story spread like wildfire across online forums and social media platforms. It's inspired countless creepypastas, online narratives designed to scare and unsettle. The rake has become an internet sensation, with its image and story being shared, retweeted and reblogged by millions around the world. But what does this all mean? Why has the rake become such a prevalent figure in our culture? Perhaps it's because the creature taps into our primal fears, our innate dread of the unknown. Or maybe it's because we love a good scare and the rake provides that in spades. And whatever the reason, one thing is certain. Like it or not, the rake has become a part of our cultural zeitgeist, a symbol of our deepest fears and darkest nightmares. In the end, the mystery of the rake remains lurking in the shadows, waiting to strike fear into the hearts of those who dare to delve into the unknown. The rake, this enigma, this creature of the night, continues to baffle us. Is it a figment of our collective imagination, spun from the threads of fear and curiosity? Or is it a lurking terror, a tangible threat that exists beyond the realm of our understanding? We may never know for sure. This final scene is not a conclusion, but rather a testament to the enduring mystery of the rake, it's a reflection on our fascination with the unknown, our insatiable thirst for answers, and our relentless pursuit of the truth. It's a reminder that, despite our best efforts, there are still mysteries in this world that remain unsolved. Creatures that elude categorization and stories that defy explanation. The intrigue that surrounds the rake is not just about the creature itself, but also about our reactions to it. It's about our desire to explore the unexplored, to understand the incomprehensible, and to confront our deepest, darkest fears. The rake embodies the unknown, the unexplained, and the unresolved. And it's this very ambiguity that continues to captivate us. But let's not forget, the more we learn about the rake, the more questions we uncover. This creature, this mystery, is not just a tale to be told, but a challenge to be met. It's a call to continue our quest for knowledge, to push the boundaries of our understanding and to keep questioning the world around us. And so the story of the rake continues, as does our quest for the truth. Remember, the unknown waits for no one, so stay curious, stay vigilant, and most importantly, stay scared. We may never solve the mystery of the rake, but that doesn't mean we should stop trying. After all, it's the journey, not the destination, that truly counts. 
As we continue to explore the unknown, let's remember to embrace the mystery, the uncertainty, and yes, even the fear. Because in the end, it's the unanswered questions that keep us coming back for more.